In case you didn't already know, this is my sister Caroline, and she asked me to make a custom shelf for her books, and so I did, um, because she's one of my favorite humans in the world, and she got me into woodworking, actually, so any project she has is usually a good idea. Her, her ideas always pan out, uh, and she's famous on YouTube, so I'm going to ride those coattails. I have no shame. Usually, if a family member asks me to make them a project, I would get really stressed out because it's for someone I'm really close with, and I want to make something really nice for them. But this was kind of a stress-free project, partly because it's for my sister. I'm super close with my sister, so I know that they're going to like anything that I make. But also, it was a really simple design. I just knew it was going to require a lot of sanding. My sister knew that this is my first finished wood project, so she's also not expecting a whole lot. So it's just sort of a learning experience, and I get to collaborate with my sister, and this will be in her house, maybe, probably forever. And then she, like, her kids will be able to see the YouTube video I made of it one day. That's, that's cool. So I was kind of focused on that and just like making something nice slowly one step at a time uh, for someone special so it was really kind of a stress-free project but I'm trying to figure out how I can incorporate that into all of my projects and just sort of take it a step at a time and if I mess up then that's what I did like I didn't know I was gonna make mistakes but I knew that there was a pretty good chance that I was so I sort of it, it budgeted for it mentally you know uh, there was room there for error and that sort of allowed me to just go through the process, learn, and not get super pissed off at myself when I make mistakes, which I made a lot of. Where the stress comes for me is when I have an expectation of how long something is going to take or how hard something is going to be, and then it doesn't measure up to those expectations, and then I'm pissed. I guess that's usually when I would calm myself down, but I don't, I don't even want to have to calm myself down. I don't want to get there in the first place, so I'm trying to shortcut life, I guess. I don't know. Like, if I have a work meeting, and they say it's going to be five minutes, but it ends up being 30 minutes, I'm going to be really sour about that. Versus if they just told me that we're going to have a work meeting, and it takes 30 minutes, then I would probably be in a, a neutral, fine mood, because that's roughly how long meetings should take, and I didn't have an expectation of how long I was going to be there. So I wasn't able to trip myself up. So, expectations need to go, I think. This is it. This is the finished product. I think I need to stop sanding now. I think I need to stop. Because A, I keep trying to fix little things. Like, there's a little dot right here I keep trying to fill, but then I turn it over and I keep knocking other things and getting more holes and finding other things. I think I just need to call it quits. I feel like I can keep working on this thing for another two months. It looks good. It looked really good. Ooh, except for that. I'll fix that. It's not bad, right? I think that this is way better than I thought it was gonna turn out, if I remember how I was thinking at the beginning of this thing. And right now I'm being way too hard on the perfection of this project. I think it's done. I need to step away and do other things. This is beautiful. I love it. I think it's great. Let me tell you about how great I am. Is that it? I think that's it. Oh, like, I don't wanna be done. No, I should be done. I gotta, ste I gotta step away.
so thrilled. This project ended up being a total joy to make for one of my favorite humans, and she freaking loved it. So, she's happy, I'm happy, the shelves are happy, the books are the happiest, and everyone's just having a great time. I gotta clean up. Yeah, those look like my dad, that's true. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Be sweet. Hit the buttons. Get a rip of it. He's just dancing. <laughs> spanking, just spanking in the corner.